What's going on YouTube, GSN right here. So in today's video I have great news for those of you who are running iOS 15.0 all the way up to 16.4, even on the newer devices like iPhone 12, 13, 14 and stuff like that. The Kawabunga might receive an update that works on those versions as well, not only 16.1.1. More on that later. This video is brought to you by AnyUnlock, a software that allows you to unlock the screen passcode, bypass MDM and even remove SIM lock. Definitely check the program out in the link below. So many of you probably remember Kawabunga. It's an application that allows multiple jailbreak related tweaks, it's a huge list in here, to be used on iOS 15.0 all the way up to 16.1.2 thanks to the Muck Dirty Cow exploit. And you can change the audio, the fonts, you can theme your icons and have like proper jailbreak themes on your device without even being jailbroken. And this one works with the newer devices as well. You can hide the dock, you can customize the passcode screen, you can customize the status bar, hide icons and stuff like that. It has a lot of features. Well apparently the developer behind Kawabanga is working on getting it to work on 16.4, 16.3.1, 16.2 and stuff like that. And they announced this, Kawabanga Lite Beta 1 for iOS 15.0 up to 16.4 plus is now out to Patreons. Patreon is here. So if you are one of the supporters on Patreon for Kawabanga, you already have access to Kawabanga Lite, but it will be available for free for the rest of the people once it exits the beta stage. And apparently you connect your device and you can tweak a lot of stuff. For the moment Kawabanga Lite light is basically a light version of Kawabanga as the name implies. It doesn't have all the tweaks that Kawabanga has because Mactertikau exploit is patched. Yes, Mactertikau exploit works only up to 16.1.2, so theoretically Kawabanga should only work up to 16.1.2. I have no idea how they got it to work on 16.4, even if it's only a couple of tweaks for the moment. Anyway, as you can see here for the moment, the Kawabanga light on iOS 16.4, 16.3, 16.2, it can do icon theming, so themes, status bar changes, springboard options and stuff like that. It is a little bit more minimalistic than the Kawabanga. As I said, the exploit that powers Kawabanga doesn't exist on iOS 16.4, neither it does on 16.2 and stuff like that. So it's a marvel of engineering that they even got it to work with those versions to begin with since Mac Cow is not available. You can see here the Kawabanga Lite theming platform. You download the theme, connect your device and it applies the theme and you have a theme on 16.4, iPhone 14 without even being jailbroken. This doesn't require a jailbreak at all. So this is actually great. It looks like the developer is deep down into development for this and they said in here that when it's entirely ready it will release for free to everybody. But it's important to know that it requires a PC to use. Kaobanga Lite requires a PC on 16.4, 16.2, 16.3. It cannot be done on the device because there is no exploit available. So the way it works is through a PC. Recently the developer made available a list of the features Kaobanga Lite has has on 16.2 and newer. It says in here easy shortcut theming with no banner, status bar tweaks, custom carrier, OTA killer, supervision, LS or lock screen footnote, mute module in the control center and other minor toggles. If you're running 16.1.2 however you should definitely not update because if you're running 16.1.2 you can have the full Kawabanga deal which contains a lot more tweaks but this one is based on the McDirtyCow exploit which doesn't exist on newer versions. Anyways we also keep a downloads page with all Mac Dirty Cow tools if you want to check them out and Kawabanga is also included in here you can download the latest IPA you can also get other Mac Dirty Cow related applications like files escape Sentender, troll tools troll box which allow you to tweak your device definitely check the page out below but yes it looks like a form of Kawabanga tweaking system will come to iOS 16.2 and newer on all devices thank you for watching I am Geosnow till the next time subscribe to stay updated and peace out